My name is Shanna Plaster and I'm an on-site coordinator for communities and schools and I'm also the Northwestern District Supervisor for Tazewell County. I think Tazewell County is one of the most beautiful places in the whole world with the best people. Everybody has a sense of community. They're very helpful. My community is on the rebound. I think we, we had a rough time when the coal industry went out and I think people either moved out of town to find better to find jobs and we had a lot of people who just felt lost and ended up with drug addictions and alcohol addictions but however I feel like our community is very supportive I feel like we have a great group of people that are there to help and, and try to motivate people out of that I, I think that We'll, we will have a different, um, different Tazewell County in a couple of years, I'm hoping, but we have really struggled through the last couple of years. And, um, but on the, our strength is that we do care and that people are willing to provide new starts and we're not judgmental, but, but we, want it, we want people to have the best life that they can in Tazewell County. Well, I have known Terry since high school. Um, and when I started my position with communities and schools, I had a need for, um, for some kids. I needed some furniture and I had asked around and somebody said, well, you should contact Blackberry Winter. Um, do you know Terry Brown? And I was like, of course I know Terry. I went to high school with her. So immediately I messaged her and she said, sure, we'll meet here. And, and I've got this and this. And so we were able to do a delivery for um, a group of kids and they had beds to sleep in that night. Well, I'm gonna start with one story um, that I really just heard about today. Um, one of the other on-site coordinators had a little girl that they had found out. She had just had brain surgery and that she was sleeping on the floor, didn't have her own bed. Um, so they immediately contacted Blackberry Winter, and I think within that day, that little girl had not only a bed, but she had new sheets and comforter and just um, felt so well taken care of and loved. In Richlands, we had a big flood in 2020, and I had a family that had pretty much lost everything. Uh, t I was able to get them some dressers, bedding, a couple of beds for the kids, and I think Terry delivered herself a, a hot water heater and maybe a washer and dryer. Um, so, and those kids' lives were completely impacted. They went from having nothing, sleeping on a plywood floor that had just been rebuilt to having a nice, warm, comfortable bed to sleep in and their clothes washed and <laughs> able to take a bath, which it had, they had been, they had to go to a church to take a bath for about a month. Communities need entities like Blackberry Winter because people need a new start. Sometimes people make mistakes and struggle, sometimes beyond um, their control, whether it's domestic violence, um, or maybe they have been arrested, maybe they've been sick and they've lost everything. Blackberry Winter can come in and give these people a new start. It gives them confidence uh, just to have a, wonderful, comfortable home. And that is not just walls, but an actual home to live and thrive in. I think we definitely need the Blackberry Winter model duplicated all over the world. I can't imagine what this would mean to third world countries, to little areas and cities. Like this is something that is very important. It's very important to Tazewell County and it should be very important everywhere. It provides resources that otherwise people do not have. Terry came from Jewel Ridge, a little community on the mountain, and they have a sense of community like I, I believe nowhere else in the world, and they still have that. Um, the kids in high school who came from Jewel Ridge always had each other's back. They were, um, they were like brothers and sisters, whether there were any relationship at all. You didn't mess with one of them or you were messing with the whole crew, but they all kind of stuck together and washed out for each other. Um, and Terry has embodied that and brought that through all of Tazewell County. And she has 
um, increased her crew to the whole, whole Tazewell County and she watches out for everybody and um, takes care of them and provides them a new start and she's not judgmental. She just absolutely loves everybody. Terry's superpower is a magician. She can come up with anything that anybody needs and she can, you can call her at two and say, I need a, a washer and dryer. And by the next hour, she's like, I found you one, here you go. But she can, she can um, just thrives in our community and can really reach out to anybody who can offer help. And she does a great job surrounding herself with our community of loving people who are willing to jump out and help. I would just say, Terry, I appreciate what you've done for our community. And I appreciate you so much and your willingness to help. A lot of people will sit back and have great ideas, but they're not willing to step out on it. And I cannot thank you enough.